If you guys are like me and have three keyboards on your desk, something like this clear look rotating keyboard tray will be something to actually declutter your desk and actually give you a little bit of just ability to where your keyboard tray is. Let's go ahead and let's get this bad baby open. Now, just as a disclaimer to guys over at Clearlook did send me this rotating desk tray to do a review and unboxing on. So let's go ahead and jump into the box here. As you can see, my box was pretty mangled when it came in. Amazon did its number on it, but first thing we are met with when we get in this box is going to be the instruction manual then we have a couple of our pu leather surface pads not sure what pu leather is but it feels really great here we have the accessories this includes the arm and the desk mounting clamp to basically put it to your desk it's up to i believe 2.7 inches and it goes down to you know of course paper thin if you want it to of course clamp it to something like that up next guys we have the actual surface the surface here as you can see is a pretty big surface i didn't know that it actually had a built-in shelf so that's a nice addition to this bad baby and as you can see here i'm sliding it open and it isn't too deep but this is good for pins maybe lens caps and as you can see here on the back we do have our mounting holes and on the front we got our holes for our pu leather surfaces so let's go ahead and get into the mounting accessory hardware box pretty nice box i really like the aesthetic of the it looks like this is like 100 percent recyclable so this is really nice packaging to me i like it to be nice and basic so let's go ahead and grab this mount of course it is pretty robust it's heavy nice little size to it and of course you're going to be getting some hardware in this packaging as well it's going to come with the allen key and of course the screws for the bottom so let me go ahead and grab this hunker out of here it is nice construction of course like an aluminum build and look at it looks really really good you got a rubber stop for the top you also have the mount there as you can see uh completely adjustable this bad baby can go 90 degrees 180 degrees it can be on the top of your desk and on the bottom of your desk so under slung and top mountain and as you can see there we got some attention to detail right here on the mount which you can't beat for this price point of this stand and what you can do so this is everything that you will get with your stand of course you will get the mounting hardware you will get the stand itself the tabletop the pu leather pads and of course the instruction manual now let's go ahead and put this bad baby together so let me go ahead and clear the desk of everything and let's go ahead and start from a clean surface so the instructions say here on the left side that we're going to be using our provided screws with the allen key to basically put the mount on the bottom of the actual desk tray so I'm gonna put my tray down first and then we're gonna go ahead and grab that hardware. All right, so this is what you're gonna to need to basically put the mount onto the bottom of our keyboard tray. So I'm gonna place it right here to the right side and bring our mount into play here. So it doesn't matter which way you actually put this on here, both sides are the same, the three on the top and the three on the bottom. So I'm gonna start by feeding some screws into the bottom side of the mount here. And the reason I'm doing this is just so I can get um, a couple of them done in, and then I can go ahead and screw them all in and don't necessarily have to hold the mount. Pretty simple, pretty easy installation. Honestly, I can give this to anybody and kind of tell them to install this and how to install this. And I think it's pretty straightforward and pretty straight to the point that you don't necessarily need any crazy tools or anything it's all provided in the packaging and of course it's really simple and really enjoyable to do and of course it's going to give a great result i can already tell by how robust the mount is so after we got our last screw all tightened up now let's go ahead and look at that instruction manual and see what is next. I believe it's time to actually put it onto the desk here. So we can actually top sling it or bottom sling it. Remember, you can use this either on the top side of your desk or on the bottom side of your desk. 
So let's go ahead and actually run this screw out on the back. We're gonna be using that big Allen key that came in our packaging. That's gonna be used to move the clamp in and out. Now you're gonna be able to clamp this up to almost three inches of a desk width. My desk width is I believe around and half an inch so it's not necessarily going to stress this mount out at all. So I guess last but definitely not least is to put the PU leather strips on there. Now these have provided holes on the opposite side. Let me go ahead and flip this bad baby over. We have provided holes as you can see on the top side and along the bottom side and those slots on the opposite side of the PU leather strip basically just fit down in there and I guess it's friction based so it shouldn't have any issues with coming out and as I'm pushing on this it feels great like the form and functionality of these are actually pretty on point and pretty robust and I like that PU leather design and feel um, it looks pretty breathable and it feels really, really breathable. I like that there's a bigger one and a smaller one here in this account. And that's just because if you, you know, didn't want to use the big one, you had a thinner keyboard, you can always flip it around and use the opposite side. So this here is the full construction and this is what you're going to be met with after going through all of the instructions. Now let me show you guys what it looks like on my desk and install it on my desk. So after you've basically got everything ready to go, basically slides right there on your desk and you just have to tighten it up. Once you get it all tightened up, it can do everything that's advertised. It can go 360 degrees in the underslung mode. It can also hold, of course, an Apple mouse and trackpad. No sag, I didn't really have too much issue when actually using the stand. Now let's go ahead and turn it upside down and go into the overslung mode or the above desk mode. As you can see here, you got pretty easy access to adjust the mount at any of the knuckles. Here's a closer look of the detail in the construction. As you can see, it's pretty easy to move up. You can go into a tabletop kind of standing position and the clamp is pretty strong. I didn't have any issues with it unloosening or, you know, being a little bit less tight than it was. As you can see, we got that nice PU leather. Feels really, really great. And of course, last but not least, we have our pen holder tray. Anyways, this has been your boy Christian. I want to thank the guys over at Clear Look for sending me this rotating keyboard tray to do this video on. I do enjoy this keyboard tray and it will be something I will be using, especially when I'm using my desk in the stand up orientation. Links down below to them will be in the description. So if you guys enjoy, make sure you hit that like button. Go check out Clear Look and I'll see you guys on the next video.